Y'all ask for it and we gonna give it to you. The beef between Big Sad 1900 from Playboy Gangsta Crip and Blueface from Schoolyard Crip Gang. Rap news and street politics. The only place you gonna get that street shit. Big Sad 1900, AKA Sad Boy, an up and coming rapper from West LA from Playboy Gangsta Crip. I done been up. Like, I didn't have, I didn't have a Porsche S550. I didn't have condos. I didn't did a lot of shit in the streets. You feel me? Wow, really? Yeah, I, 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 I didn't did some things. You feel me? And it's like, um, but I'm still a gang member, so gang banging and dealing with sh lawyer fees hmm. and dealing with everything I had to deal with. I didn't been, I didn't went flat broke. You know what I'm saying? Really? That's why I said when I, I seen Meek Mill get out of jail in the helicopter. I'm like, man, all rappers get out of jail and they still got money. Like hmm. they be up. You feel me? I'm like, what is it? I'm like, what is it? What is it I can do? Mm. Big Sad has been making a lot of noise for himself in the last couple years, linking up with Treyway 6K from A Trey Hoover and the Baby Stone Gorillas from the Jungles. Recently, Big Sad did a collab with BPS because they share common enemies with Schoolyard Crip, which is the same hood Blueface is from. In the song Mainline, Sad and other BPS members can be seen throughout the video dissing Schoolyard and Blueface. Blueface has yet to respond. Tuck my fingers up in the air, I throw gang signs. Boy, you seen yellow, you ain't never see that main line. Tuck my dick, then she get to calling you on FaceTime. Pop the scrap up, he ain't tripping, he gon' take on. Big Sad and the Playboys' main rivals are the schoolyard Crips. They share close hoods in West LA. Give a fuck if he like it, but he gon' respect the scripts. Yeah, I saw funny games till his nigga trippin'. Mock the blow, hide the west side just to catch him slipping. Slippin'. Pull up, bounce out with a briefcase, it's time to handle business. Big Sad also got beef with Schoolyard Crip ally, Venice Showline Crip. In this video, you can see Blueface with two extra who just got murdered down. I wonder if Blueface next. Here, he can be seen kicking over candles for fallen Venice Showline member two extra earlier this year. Blueface has been making a lot of action on the YouTube scene, knocking security guards out and all that. But he ain't in the field in Mid City hunting down them PBGs who just killed his homie from Venice Showline. Big Sad is trying to branch out and go to different hoods throughout LA. And you can tell by linking up with Treyway for that record, Voices in My Head. The PBGs and the Hoovers are far apart, but it's good to see some unison throughout the city. Little bro, nose running. Bitch, I ain't never seen you hustle. You can't hold now. I'm fucking with the eight trays. I'm fucking with the baby. Fight one niggas out the 50 shell and mayday. 15 minute phone calls and money on that shape. On that tape. New York for fix. Name Lele. It makes sense for Big Sad to be over there with Treyway 6K from A Trey Hoover. Now, I don't know if this is part of the moving groove and Sue Whooping movement, but they got the common enemies with all the neighborhood crips. Blueface has never came out publicly and dissed Big Sad or the Playboy Gangsters. And being a bigger artist, maybe he just want to keep quiet, but Big Sad is paving his own way throughout the streets. And it looks like the beef between him and Blueface may heat up, especially now that he teamed up with BPS members to go against the schoolyards. But some people are questioning whether or not a crip like Big Sad should be hanging out in the BPS hood. And he responds to his critics. What y'all think about the Playboy Gangster? Is him and Blueface rivalry gonna explode? Is Blueface even gonna say something about him dissing two extra? Where y'all think Big Sad gonna go after this? Will this have an impact on Sad music career? Let us know in the comments. Y'all make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Let us know who else you wanna see in these streets. Rap news and street politics, the only place you gonna get that street shit.